so weird seeing you ride and it not making any noise. <clears throat> I can't complain about the bike. Maybe the tires. Yeah. But this is real dusty, real dry. It, there's no traction today yeah. at all. Yeah. I can't imagine it on 80. So when I went through one of those turns and I got into, I can't remember my straightaways, but I got into the turn, way up on the tank, and when I came out, I just gave it all she got. Yeah. It came off the ground. It's a little nerve wracking. It's that. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Holy crap. Well, let's get up in the woods before it gets too dark. Okay. And uh, so most of my stuff, it's nothing any, you know, nothing very challenging but there's a lot of stuff that's like tight and off camber okay. but i mean you should you shouldn't have any issue all right be good so i'll give you the give you the tour Given the tires, like I can feel a difference between my tires and these tires. Like, yeah, these are motocross tires. It's amazing how much traction it gets. It, it spins different. Yeah. Does that make sense? I don't know how to say it. Yeah, it does. It's got some kind of traction control too. Something you get like somewhere that. slick, you'll notice it. Plus, I was giving it gas. I can make it spin, but man, I can just let off, and it just, it just. It it's not like all or nothing like people think electric is. Yeah. It's it, it comes on really good too. So I got a set of amp wheels with a 525 cheater and a golden tire for the front I'm gonna put on there Friday. Oh I bet that'll help a lot. You'll notice a big difference. Oh yeah. <laughs>
He's in that nasty spot down there in the bottom. There you go. I oh, know it's too easy. It's too easy. So technically the tires are okay, but it's like So I got stuck down there on the Suron. Yeah. The the Ultra B and it's more all or nothing and I couldn't get out. I had to lift it out. Right. But that thing, if you rock it a little bit, it'll pull you out. Well, so my problem was I got I got this in the fence. I was just being a little too nervous, but once I got down in it rock wouldn't go rock i just had to get feel for it got up that next big root right over mainly just oh yeah like it makes me want to just turn and go down in the woods and see what it does yeah we're about to do that in a minute okay uh there's one more awkward spot up here kind of like that yeah so kind of lean uphill it's kind of like you got to lean to the right and turn to the left you just okay. watch me to go that way and the tree fell. I, I'm in awe, man. <laughs> right here. <laughs> nice!
See if he comes up out of there. Nice. It's really bizarre. <laughs> How good it is? It's a controlled power. Because back during the hot that log and I got crooked, I just went down in the woods again. Didn't matter what I came up over. Plenty of power when you got there. Not like, oh, you know. Right. None of that. It's like they've whatever they've done with the software and the mapping, they figured it out. So smooth. I don't know how it I don't I don't know how it senses that. But I, I would be afraid to climb no hills. None. 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 Yeah, and you can you don't have to use momentum at all. Yeah. Like you can just it will keep the constant RPM the whole way up the hill. There's yeah. no it's nuts. I catch myself only needing to adjust my grip. Because <laughs> I want to give it more gas. That's it. It's amazing. Yeah. All right, now we. Rimbo's on my bike. These brakes are better than yours. Better. Really? It's, it's got you got Maguras. Yeah. I haven't spent enough time on them to really notice the difference. Mine just seems softer. These seem more like instant. Yeah. Yeah. I, I just prefer it. Yeah. All right, this side of the mountain now. Yeah, I got a stick in my brake. I got a stick caught right here and I kept looking down trying to fix it and yeah. I kept making it worse. <laughs> and then I slid into that tree. <laughs> oh my God. All right, I'm going up through here. Okay. I just want to see what it feels like. Yeah, have at it. And then I'll come right back down. That's how, yeah, do it. And if I want to be on two or three, I don't want any braking. Let's just go. Now just watch how good this thing goes up through. Okay. <laughs> Center a little too far. <laughs>
<sighs> yeah, I mean, it looked like it climbed it with ease, man. Watch out for that tree. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it was your turn. Oh, it stopped me. I'm trying to go around this log. Man, it just goes right. It's nuts. It's a hill climbing machine. You put my, my favorite tires on here, it'll go anywhere. I think. <laughs> oh, yeah. Anywhere. Alright, we'll go back down around the way you have when you pass Yeah, yeah, we'll keep going. Is that way and then we're going? I gotta climb for you. <laughs> I got a bug in my... What a mess it feels like up through there. And to have to deal with all the different things and feel the power delivery. Because it hopped, spun. As soon as it landed, got right back. Didn't go, what? It doesn't bog. It doesn't, no, like, it just goes right go crazy. I know. People don't believe me. I'm just a paid chill, John. Little drop off here. Watch out on all this stuff because it looks grassy and smooth, but there's holes and big rocks okay. everywhere. It's real easy on that, but on this, it's like there's some roots, yeah. and I got maybe a 75% success rate. And it kind of stays to the left of those couple trees up there. Yeah, it kind of yeah, it kind of stays to the left of those trees, and then once you get up the top there, there's a little flat pad. Awesome. That's the plan. <laughs> Comes Blinger! Oh! Ho, ho. Nice! That's exactly what I wanted to feel it do. Yeah. Now I know. Yeah. Golly, it's great. 